how uh, how important is it for you guys to get one like this? You know, I mean, you you played well lately, but you had so many this season that you've lost. Uh, it's very important. Um, you know, Steph has hit several shots like that down the stretch this year, and we we haven't been able to close it out on the defensive end. So it's very important for us to get those stops down the stretch and make sure we close the game out. And also coming back off the road, I think we built some momentum on the road. So you want to make sure you come back and and um, take care of the ones at home that you can. How fearful were you, though, with that foul situation late? Um, I wasn't fearful at all. I knew I didn't make contact. Uh, I mean, even the, the Wiggins. Oh, I mean, well, that's uh, – I knew we had a foul to give there. So I was – I wasn't worried about the foul at all um, when they called that on Wiggs. You know, I knew we only had two team fouls, so I thought it was actually the smartest play you could make. The last time you guys played the Suns is when you had the incident with, with Yusuf, and tonight you guys are going back and forth, two small celebrations, all that stuff. I mean, is that just kind of the, the fire that you like? And when you're in the midst of it, does it ever kind of come into your mind of, okay, Draymond, take it up to here? And then we leave it at that line. No, nah, because I didn't take it anywhere. Um, you know, they called a foul on the post up, and he started talking. Never backing down from that. I like that type of action. What do you think of the two small celebration that, that you, you seem to get involved? You can't get bullied a couple plays later if you're going to do that. <laughs> you can't be a nothing defender if you're going to do that. So, you know, you you're going to do all of that. You. Man will probably outweigh me by 70 pounds. And you get put in the rim, got to be more careful. Uh, defensively, you guys have been t sort of trending up since you, you came back. But what kind of energy does Gary bring uh, that changes things? Uh, a lot of energy. Uh, G's <clears throat> has some of the quickest hands in the league, uh, gets a ton of deflections. The ball pressure that he brings um, is absolutely amazing. You know, you can put G on the other team's best player, and he's going to make it tough on them. And as a defender, that's all you hope for, uh, to make guys take tough shots and you live with the results. And so, um, you know, but it's also good to have G offensively as well. You know, G does a lot of things offensively that no one necessarily gives him credit for. And, um, you know, he he's just knows how to find the right spot. And so uh, G was real big for us in that. Dre, I do wonder, were you in a different headspace at all because it was Nurk and just that connection to the, the game prior? And when he's testing you like that, pretty obviously just trying to get under your skin, you got the moment when you know you, you get the offensive foul and you're pointing at your head, saying you're going to think this thing through, and then late, it seems like he checks you and then hits you. Oh, no, you. I, was, uh, I was saying he was a dummy. <laughs> uh, when I was pointing to my head, I wasn't necessarily Appreciate saying. Appreciate the clarification. Yeah, I wasn't necessarily saying. Uh, I, I was keeping my head. I was saying, uh, you can't start talking and, and charging to me. That's not smart. Right. So. And then late, it, it did seem like he hit you. You don't retaliate. You got two layups at the rim. You, I think, find Kaminga for the oop. You know, in terms of composure, it, you just know right then, like, you can do whatever you want. I'm going to try to win this game. He was hitting me a lot today. Uh, you should go back and watch the film. Just, like, key in on him and look at him. It was a lot of little cheap shots. But, uh, you know, I knew his goal was to get me out the game. Uh, no one wants to see me in the game. That makes the game a lot tougher. And so, um, but I'm not. Uh, that's It'd take a pretty good ish talker or to to get me to do that. I mean, that's just too obvious, you know. So, it's okay. It was a fun game. Real quick follow. Team-wide, this is six out of seven. Uh, defense coming in tonight, I think since the start of the month, was was fourth in the league and, and another good night tonight. Are you starting to see the direction of what it could be? Absolutely. Uh, you know, I think we're doing a really good job of uh, playing great team defense and flying around. And then we're also, I think, uh, doing a pretty good job of uh, rebounding the basketball. Uh, and I think, you know, that's 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 the key for us. You know, you can get all the stops you want uh, or force all the misses you want, uh, but if you're not able to get the rebound, you know, it makes it a lot tougher. And for us, we also understand that if we are able to rebound, then we get off to the races and it's hard for teams to keep up with the speed that we have out there on the floor. So, um, you know, it's it's a concerted effort uh, for, from every guy that steps on the floor uh, to make sure that we're defending 
uh, and, and making it tougher on the other team to score and, uh, and then also making sure that they feel us. Hey, Drama. Love you. Um, sorry to keep bringing up Nurkic, but he said after the game that he felt that your antics tonight proves that you didn't learn anything. I'm just wondering if you had any response to that. I mean, I thought I was pretty great tonight, honestly. <laughs> um, you know, so I thought, you know, he tried to get in my head and it didn't work. If he want me to walk around quiet like him, I'm never going to do that. Quiet guys don't win. Um, so, yeah, I thought I was pretty great tonight. Uh, so, yeah, he can keep riding the same horse that he came, rode in on. He can ride his ass on out here on the same horse. It ain't working. Just a quick follow-up. Uh, what have you learned? Sorry, you Adam. I didn't mean to curse. That just slipped out. <laughs> God, sorry. Uh, what have you learned since your suspension? That when I'm in the game, we are a very good basketball team. Incredible. Um, and I think people are starting to see that. So that's what I've learned. Draymond, back here. What do you like about what you're seeing on this sheet? Um, <clears throat> out rebounding a team that's supposed to have a bunch more size than us, 52 uh, to 41. Um, you know, you, you hold that team to. 45 from the field and 31 from three. That's a team with three of the best scorers in the NBA. Uh, and, you know, to do that defensively, I thought was absolutely incredible. Um, you know, the points off turnovers were pretty much a wash. Uh, you know, if we can control that, uh, that's that's always a key for us. Uh, second chance points, 21 to 13. Thought that was a big thing. You know, it just shows that the energy that we brought to the game was there. And, um, you know, it was a fun game to play in. I think everybody who came in stepped up to the challenge, and, uh, you know, that was um, key to why we were able to pull out the win. And yet, you know, I don't think we, we – I thought we missed a lot of shots that we could still make, you know, some open looks that – you know, some bunnies that we missed. And so, uh, you know, it was good effort by us tonight. Hey, Draymond, you had that uh, three-pointer early. Right here, sorry. Three-pointer early couple finishes through Nurk, that fake DHO at the end when he went between your legs, obviously. That was nice. Yeah, that was, nice. Ooh, that was <laughs> moving right there, boy. Uh, you did what you do as a playmaker. Just how comfortable are you feeling offensively, individually right now? I'm confident, you know, and uh, I think, you know, it's important. You know, my teammates has the utmost confidence right now in me on the offensive end. My coaching staff, you know, Kenny's like, Draymond, keep shooting threes, keep shooting threes. I'm like, all right, I got you, but, you know, I'm never going to just – up a bunch of threes. It's just not who I am. But um, I feel like I'm in a good groove, you know, finding my uh, rhythm. And, you know, I think our team is finding a good rhythm. So I think it's coming together for us at the right time. You know, we got, what, three more games before the All-Star break. I think it's important that we make sure we, we roll into the All-Star break so we can roll out of the All-Star break. You know, you don't want to stumble in come out trying to gain momentum. I think we have some good momentum right now. We need to make sure we keep that going.